Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Terror. I hope everyone is well. I apologize for my absence. I have had a very hard time recovering from the laryngitis. And at the bread and butter job, you know, my normal 50 hour a week doing what I do thing, um, I have to do a lot of talking. So there's days where I will come home and it's not even like this is this is a good day. And so anyway, long story short, we're back. <laughs> okay. Because I've delayed March long enough. So Pisces, it's your season. We're going to start with you. So you're going to be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of March, 2021. If Pisces is your sun sign and it's resonating with you, cool. It's your free will to do what you choose to do with the message given by the guard. If you choose to do anything at all. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate with your sun sign, that's okay. You can check your moon rising or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watch. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the prior sign to our table. Everybody's always welcome here, and I appreciate you stopping by today. As long as you're here, if you, you know feel like you might want to see more if we're vibing if you're liking it hit the subscribe button the notification bell so you can know when i upload if you like what you see feel free to hit the like button i'm not going to twist your arm i'm not going to tell you how to live if you want to do it if you don't that's okay i'm still here i'm just doing my thing throwing down cards having a good time okay a couple of quick reminders before i throw down for pisces for march 2021 one if it is not your reading, if it is not your message, if it's not relatable at all, leave the cards on the table and walk away. Don't take with you what doesn't belong to you. That's how fights get started. Two, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. I'm a tarot reader myself. I would never in a million years do that. Okay. <sighs> Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have. For Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for March of 2021, thanks for coming by today and playing cards with us. We ask for messages for Pisces to bring them to their highest possible spiritual good. Pisces, why are you here? Hmm. King of Pentacles in the reverse. Make some space here. Um, wow. I may have to throw a clarifier on that. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Because that... It's indicating to me that things aren't as they seemed. Like, not the catch you thought it was? Could be. Again, we'll see what the rest of the cards have to say. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? The world. Okay. Something's coming to a close. It happens. The Zodiac year is about to come to a close, so... The middle of this month, Pisces ends, Aries begins, the Zodiac year, the wheel. Exactly. Hmm. Are you ending an old cycle or beginning a new one? Huh. What do you think of the person you're dealing with? Nice swords verse, I don't think you're talking. Pardon me. Somebody's not talking. Communication could have been cut off. Hmm. What do you want from them, of them, for them, from them, the Emperor? Get your crap together? Hmm. 
How do they feel about you, Pisces? Two cups reversed. Wow. Okay. Feelings mutual? You know, this is not the high vibration breed I wanted for you guys. But I don't sugarcoat anything, so... Let's just see what the rest of the cards have to say. Let's disconnect. What do they think of you? Seven of Swords reversed. Okay. Plans coming to a screeching halt. Possibly truths coming out. What do they want of, for, or from you? Temperance reversed. Patience. Wow. What was the obstacle here? Queen of Swords. Truth. Cold, icy truth. Possibly someone being a little bit too honest. Possible resolution. Four of Pentacles. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Save up, stock up, don't let go, hang on, hang on. We're going to leave that for the end. I need clarity. It's one of those that's making sense, but I need more information for it to make sense. Does that make sense? Something's coming to an end. There's a disconnect here, but why? Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity of the cards on the table for my Pisces friends, please? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. March 2021. <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, who came out? Four of Cups. And the Four of Pentacles. We'll see if they come back out. Okay, one more. They're telling me to stop shuffling. Page of Swords. Little Messenger of Truth. Oh, that little Page of Swords. Sometimes the uh, mm, verbal diarrhea would be the phrase I'd use. Um, sometimes he tells you things you don't necessarily want to hear, but he speaks truth. So, possibly you got a communication. Could have been through a third party. Doesn't necessarily have to, or didn't necessarily have to. Things were not as they seemed for some of you. 
Hmm. Truth. Truth came out. Truth came out. Why is the world here? Thanks. Queen of Cups reversed. How do you feel about the person or situation you're dealing with? It's coming to an end. Queen of Cups reverse. The feeling isn't there. Withdrawn feelings. Either you're withdrawing your feelings or you feel like they are. Okay. Hmm. Four of Wands. Stability, it's a card of stability. Also a card of soulmate connection. Nah. I don't think in this instance. I think you're trying to regain stability. Why is the Knight of Swords reversed here? Hi. Three of Pentacles, Eight of Wands. That's an energy of avoidance. Why the Eight of Wands? Two of Wands. Lack of Foundation. Are you avoiding this person? doing that thing. Hold on. Okay. Are you avoiding this person? Letting go, moving on with a quickness, not talking, lack of a foundation. Somebody's getting ready to let go and move on. I'm just going to leave this stick here. I'm going to walk this way toward, toward that stick. Yeah. And I'm going to do it very quickly. That, I think that's where some of you are at right now. Why is the Emperor here? Why is the Emperor here for what Pisces wants of, for, or from the person they're dealing with or the situation they're dealing with? You want to talk. The magician. Okay. Lovers reverse. So you would like for them to get their crap together, maybe? Could be you want this for them. Or of them, not necessarily from them. Get your crap together. Manifest new positive things in your life. I don't think they got a lot of positive things going on. Not by the feels of this. We'll check it out in a second. But you don't want them to try to do it with you. 
lovers reversed. Please don't pick me. Please don't pick me. I'm picking up Dustin off and moving on, but you go have a bright future elsewhere. That's what I'm getting out of this. I think you're the salt of the earth, but you're not the salt of the earth that I want. Okay. Why is the two of cups reversed here for what the other person feels of Pisces? Queen of Swords reversed. Ouch! Ouch! Well, that was fun while it lasts, but somebody's got a bad attitude. <laughs> okay? I, I was sensing a little bit of a negative attitude down here. I was. But if certain truths came, up, came out about certain things, I, I will not fault Pisces for having a bad attitude if they do. Why is Seven of Swords reversed here? What the other person thinks Pisces? Why is the Seven of Swords reversed here? Six of Pentacles, Six of Wands, King of Cups. Wow, that's a whole lot of information. Fair, generous, so much love to give. Why is the Six of Wands here? Stop moving. Thank you. Empress reversed. Not going to go anywhere. Possibly a little bit cocky. This came out. It's not going to blossom and grow into what it could have. Taking the high road of victory after the battle. I just keep hearing, in all fairness, in all fairness, in all fairness. In all fairness, somebody was dishonest here. Things were not as they appeared. In all fairness. Pisces, they think the world of you, but they understand why you made the decision you did, if you made that decision. In all fairness. In all fairness. Wow. Oof. Why is temperance reversed here for what the other person wants of, for, or from Pisces? Why is temperance reversed here? Knight of Cups reversed. The Hermit. Oh, wow. Pisces, are you a little ticked off? I mean, I don't blame you if you are, 
But are you a little ticked off? The light of forgiveness. I don't know why I just heard the light of forgiveness. There's a negative energy here. They understand that your cup got dumped. They get that. But they want you to go inside and find the light of forgiveness. Why the hermit? Make sure I'm right about this. Why the hermit? Thank you. Temperance upright. Wow. Wow. I sense a little bit of a blame game going on here. I, I don't want to delve too deep into this, but things happened. Things happened. They just want an improvement of the energy. Okay. Why did it all come down? Queen of Swords, what the Queen of Swords do? The Queen of Swords demands truth. At all times. She hates your guts less if you just be honest with her. And right now she's right side up. So why is the Queen of Swords here? For what the obstacle was in this connection. Thank you. The world. Old cycles ending, new cycles beginning. King of Wands. Ooh. You know what the King of Wands is? To me, and I feel compelled to say this, I I don't think I'm wrong. Uh, other readers and scholars would probably argue with me the King of Wands sometimes is nothing more than the grown-up version of the Knight of Wands. And we know what the Knight of Wands is. The Knight of Wands is the Playboy, the Tarot. Things went down. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna dance around what may have gone down in your situation. Things went down. Old cycles ended, new cycles began. Why the King of Wands? It's got to stop moving. Mm. Ten of Wands reversed. Someone failed to end a cycle. Something that was supposed to come to an end didn't. And there's a whole lot of wands up there. And if you're picking up what I'm putting down, send an email, leave a message in the comments. We'll talk about it over coffee. I just bought a curd the other day. So, I got loads of coffee. Anyway. Could have been things of a certain nature, sugar and spice and all things nice, if you're picking up what I'm putting down. Anyway, what is the possible resolution? Why the Four of Pentacles? Oh, do you want to talk? Eight of Swords. Why the Eight of Swords? Page Cups reversed. Hmm.
Eight of Cups. One more. Queen of Wands. Oh my. Oof. Oof, Pisces, oof. This is not a time where I want to see a king and a queen of wands on the same spread. Oh, why? <sighs> Guard your heart, definitely. Don't allow it to consume you, but don't just let that go either. If that makes any sense. It might not be a good idea to talk for a while. You may both have to kind of move on from each other for a minute before it consumes you. Why the Queen of Wands? Oh, the shadow side. Okay. That makes sense. This is potentially, like, toxic. You may need to just kind of not talk. Just kind of go about your business, separated elsewhere. Allow this to come to an end if it's supposed to. Because this was potentially toxic. Yes, th they would like forgiveness. Pisces, that doesn't mean you have to give it. I think it, I think, obviously you want the best for them. You would like them to move on. We talked about this a few minutes ago. You would like them to move on without you. You want them to get their crap together and manifest new wonderful things in their life without you because they've already lost you. That's fair. Okay. If that's what you want. Okay. I mean, by the looks of things, this is definitely potentially toxic. But, you know... And again, I want to point fingers because all things can be vice versa here. I don't know who did what. I wasn't there. I wasn't there. Energies could improve between you. Let's put it that way. 
outcome, King of Cups reversed. Why the King of Cups reversed? I think eventually, yeah, Five of Cups reversed. Eventually, it won't be so emotional. It won't be so raw. And it won't hurt so much. Because eventually, you'll walk away from the river of tears. Because I think right now, this hurts a lot. Right now, this, this hurts. And yeah. When things aren't what you thought they were going to be. And you find out in the worst way possible. Which I think for some of you, you did. That hurts. I think you're doing the right thing. If you're choosing to move on without them and you would like them to go about their business without you, you could have that honest conversation. But are you at a point where you can have that honest conversation without the toxic ties bringing you back together into another go around of a t potentially toxic situation? Let's see what the cards have to say. Let's... Uh, you can forgive them without forgiving them. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Knight of Wands and the Hair of Fent reversed. I cannot say that. You're not going to make me say that. There are certain people in this world that you will never be able to tame. Pisces. Don't try. If the beast wants to be tamed, it will tame itself. You cannot force that upon someone. Two of swords, eight of wands. Sometimes you have to make the difficult decision to just move forward and move forward with a quickness, but don't make that difficult decision without all the possible information. So make sure you get both sides of the story. Okay. Death and the Seven of Swords. If you're going to bring a cycle to an end so new cycles can begin, make sure you didn't leave anything at their house. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you end it and there's nothing to go back for. You know what the Seven of Swords is to me? You see this guy? See how he's leaving a couple swords behind and he's got five swords with him? He done left something behind. Make sure nothing gets left behind. Make sure they don't have a reason to come back. You know what I'm saying? Karma and the Queen of Pentacles. Hmm. Concentrate on you. Your stability. Your self-worth working on you to make you a better you because you are a catch and you deserve a catch. Okay? Okay? Just let this come to an end. All right. It's been 34 minutes. Sorry, I'm a little rusty. I haven't read cards in a while. Thanks for stopping by, taking these 35 minutes to come hang out with me. Pisces, I love you. Be blessed. This will be your last reading for the Zodiac year. Well, your last sign reading for the Zodiac year. Okay. Because um, if I do mid-months, I won't be doing another Pisces reading until after the middle of the month when the Zodiac year rolls over. And we all talked about this last year because with spring and the revolving of the Zodiac wheel starts a new year for me. I mean, yeah, we all celebrate New Year's in January, but... Sorry, I'm in the school of thought of the new year comes around when the zodiac wheel comes around. So, anywho, I love you, be blessed, and we will catch you next time.